Welcome to the Ghost Key. I am Gray, and today we're gonna get started on Blaine's Gym. Now, in between the last episode and this episode, since we had to start, or I started talking about dropping a deuce, I had to go drop a deuce. In other words, I had to go take a shit. Just thought you guys should know. I, I thought that was very relevant information that you guys should know. Uh, I'm just saying. Just, I'm just saying. I mean, I, it's, it's important. It's important to me. Bowel movements are important to me. So I was beating up this little fucking Growlithe. We should, we should, we should, we could, we might be okay, I don't know. Well, we'll see. We'll see how much surfing we can do. Because that's what we're pretty much going to do, is just spam surf. I mean, that's really what everyone does in fire gyms and stuff. Because, I mean, what else are you supposed to do? Fucking, you know. Although this little thing will probably give us a run for our money right here. This little fucker. I'm going to use prison. I don't even know what that does. What does that do? I'm not even sure. But we're gonna we're gonna take that right quick, right quick, yo. Um, I'm not even sure. I might, I might be. I might just go ahead and fucking do this, just cause I can today and I got some time and I'm kind of feeling good. But then after I do that, I'm gonna be done. I might actually just go and record uh the next gym, the Viridian City gym, as well after this. I might. Like I said, I might. It all depends on how I'm feeling after this episode and all that good shit. And shit. Look at that. Mm, eat up, eat up, eat up. That fucking experience. Look at that. He just beat up, was it? At least three Pokemon that were three levels higher than him and took, what, six damage? Six damage, right? Six damage. I'll tell you how wet they can get. Oh, yep, I went there. I went there. By the way, right now I I got I got the TV on. I, you know I, I I'm sorry. I uh, when I when I watch when I watch TV or movies or anything like that, I should tell you right now. I I feel like I'm wasting time. I don't have much time as it is, and I like to play video games. I mean, hence why I'm doing this, right? And, in all honesty, when I sit down and I just watch TV, you know, like, like, I know Netflix and all that shit is the fucking rage right now. That's all everyone can give a fuck about. But I'm sorry, I cannot sit down and just watch a fucking TV show from end to end. I, I, to me it feels like a waste of fucking time. Because there's so many, I mean, so many great games out there that I want to play. There's so many good books out there I want to read. And honestly... When I sit there and I watch TV, that to me is a fucking waste of time. So whenever I sit down and play a game, especially on my computer, um, you know, which I use my giant television for the monitor and all that stuff, but it's in my living room, I, we also have a smaller TV, and I, I'll just watch, you know, see if there's anything halfway interesting on TV and, and watch that. Anyway. Um, I, I, I turned on the TV and I kind of stumbled across the NBA D-League because that's kind of going on right now. And I'm sorry, I've seen some good basketball games in my life. But this, I think I'm watching was it San Antonio and uh, fucking Utah. This is like the worst basketball game I've ever seen in my life. How much do I want to bet this is going to burn me? No? This is a Snapdrag Confusion, fucker. And these guys are just fumbling around like fucking everywhere. The ball's flying. It's like watching fucking ten-year-olds play ball. I'm sorry. I you know I'm I'm not. I'm usually not that mean of a person when it comes to shit like sports. Just cause you know I like sports a lot, but man, it's hard to watch. Hey buddy, how you doing? That's a nice nice red door you got there. How's? Are you gonna paint it? Like green I mean you have the green green walls and shit and this nice brown floor here you know how about we just fight instead and I'll fucking kick your ass but I mean yeah I mean there's been several shots in this game that have like 
completely missed the fucking rim and everything. And it's it's shocking. And I feel bad for, for the kids that are playing right now. Because it's you know, kind of trying to put on a show and earn a contract and shit like that. And God damn. It's, it's hard to watch. But anyhow. Um, so, yeah. So you've learned a little bit about me today. Number one, I like basketball. Number two, I don't have fucking Netflix. Oh, God. What are they sending out? When you brought this guy. This little guy. Oh, this little fucker. Um... Yeah, so I, I hate the Netflix thing. Like like I said, I, I just, I cannot fucking do that shit. I got better things to do with my time. I got way too many great games that need to be played than just sit there and fucking watch some crap-ass television show that everyone tells me to fucking watch. I'm a bit of a defiant asshole. If, if you haven't fucking noticed, like, shit that fucking people tell me to do or fucking want me to do or, you know, recommend me doing... I, I kind of don't fucking like that shit. Same thing with, with anything trendy. I mean, I'm sure you've caught on to that right now. Or right now, by now. Let's add that or you're just thinking I'm a complete asshole and just completely ignore me. Which is very, very possible. You know, I'm starting to think we might, if we're lucky, we're like 38 when we fight Blaine. I still think we got a good chance because I mean, we're just rolling through here. Just rolling through here. And he's gotten two levels already. We're almost out of surfs. Jesus, see, there's another shot that's completely missed the rim and only hit backboard. That's just wow. Just wow. Just wow. Super nerd. This motherfucker. Super nerd. I am a super nerd. I know what Star Trek is. That's something I have an issue with. People that call themselves self proclaimed, oh, I'm so nerdy. I shop at American Eagle. Say, so, yeah, yeah, mm. Oh, and, and you know, yeah, you're one of those assholes who just tries to memorize everything so you can win arguments. Yeah, those are good people. Good people. Hopefully you've caught up by now that I just don't like people. I think that's my problem. Now, Pokemon, on the other hand, I can get along with Pokemon. But, uh, people not so much. Although, this brown floor is fucking stellar. I love this tile. This is kick-ass. The green is a little weird, but I like it. I like it. I like it. Although, this gym really does add credence to the whole, um, you know, Blaine's a super mad scientist who spliced some of his DNA with Mew to make Mewtwo theory. Also, Mr. Fuji's involved, but, yeah. Like I said, check out that shit. If, if you're into like any, if you're one of those assholes who's into like conspiracy theories and the fucking government did it and shit like that, like I am, the Pokemon conspiracies are pretty cool. All the little underlying fucking things. God damn, that thing was six levels higher than us. We just fucked his shit up. Just get out. Just take a nap. Fucking whatever your name is, burglar guy. No one cares about you. I know why Blaine became a trainer to fucking make genetic Pokemon and shit. I'm just gonna keep talking about that. That's all there is to it. Rapidash. Let's see what I'm doing against this Rapidash. Now I suspect at minimum, at minimum, two surfs. I would be surprised if it did like if one of them did like three quarter damage. Two quarter damage, three three quarters of its damage. Yeah, oh shit! I am surprised. Yeah, fire spin. Cool move, but nah, very few, very few, very little, very limited use. It's one of those things where it's like, why would you, eh, I don't know. I mean, I understand if you're going to set up, but it's not even that tough of a Pokemon, like, defense-wise. I mean, it's not really one of those real sturdy Pokemon that's going to take some hits and, you know, fuck shit up for you. And I don't even think, I'm not sure, I'm not even sure how diverse of a move pool Rapidash has. I like diversity, if you haven't noticed. I, I, I like that. I like that a lot in my Pokemon. I like I like being able to cover a lot of angles. Hence why I love Hitmonchan so much. But I can't use because they fucked this bullshit up in this generation. And that makes me sad. That makes me very sad. But that's okay. I'm just gonna beat up four eyes over here. 
I've been to many games. Weird sprite. Guy looks like he should be driving like a fucking like an Econa line van with shag carpeting in it, right? Anyway. Oh, the burn! Finally, the burn. Not that it matters, cause yeah, I'm not really interested in it. It's. I think I'm gonna be honest with you. I think at 38, at 38, we'll be fine. I really think so. Hopefully there's one or two more guys in here. 36 might be a bit of a stretch. I think 37 we could do it. Just because, I mean, we've been fucking spanking the shit out of everything so far. Um, so I, I really think... I really think we'll be all right. And we can get, you know, is this, please don't tell me this is the, ah, uh, ah, uh, yeah, thank God. Uh, we'll just suffer through the burn for this. Fire is weak against H2O. Thanks for telling me exactly what it takes to kick your ass. Not that I haven't figured it out in like the seven trainers here. Which, by the way, I think we can skip all these fights. I think if you go over to the machine thing there, you answer some fucking question or some shit. I'm not interested in that for obvious reasons. I mean, you're gonna sniff my ass. Thanks a lot, dog. Take that, fire puppy. Yeah. Drown your ass. That really. Ooh. And he brings out this guy. Ah. Uh, 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 I hope there's at least one grudge. That doesn't sound good. That doesn't sound good. What does that do? I'm frightened. Somebody hold me. I don't know what's going on. Oh, shit. You are a prick. God damn, am I glad. Oh, man. That's something I'm, I'm scared of now. I don't know. You, okay, you're a creepy old guy. All right. Okay, that frightens me. That that frightens me a lot, actually. Something like that could really ruin everything, which then means we have to turn to Stella or Chode, which I think we could, since they're pretty much on par level-wise. We can probably figure out a way to either pump a couple potions into them and survive, or just you know, oko them and 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 get out of there. But I, I think I think we can we can we can be all right if if we if we don't if we don't incur too much too much shit. Anyway, um, that's it for this episode. If you made it this far on YouTube, you know what to do. Thanks a lot for watching, and remember, pants are optional. <laughs>